Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Melissa, also known as Green Eye Phoenix Goddess here on YouTube. I am a Pisces, but I love all signs. I love everybody. I deal with all signs, but I think you'll find guys as a Pisces, I try to do lots of different things here on my channel. So please stay tuned to all of the amazing things coming. I do member perk memberships. Um, I have my website. I do personal readings. I do all kinds of amazing stuff. I also have subscription boxes that you can sign up for. So I have lots of fun different things that I do on my channel. So I really hope that you'll look around and that you'll join the family and that you'll subscribe. So don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. And to all my returning subscribers, you guys know how much I love and appreciate you so much. Guys, as you know, these readings are always very general, so anything that is pertaining to your particular energy, please, anything that is pertaining to my channel will always be linked down below. How to book personal readings with me, how to donate to my channel, how to follow me on Instagram and Facebook, any type of sales or deals or anything, everything will always be linked down below in regards to my channel. So, with all that being said, guys, let's get into the video. Pisces! Happy birthday, Pisces! Pisces season is officially upon us, guys. I am so excited. I don't even understand how my birthday is only two weeks away. So, if it is your birthday, Pisces, today, happy birthday. Obviously, happy birthday to all the Pisces for the season. So, welcome to your monthly kind of like check-in, kind of like self-care, spiritual, I guess, kind of like energy check-in. I don't know what I'm going to title it, title it yet. But um, at any rate, we're going to pull some tarot, then we're going to pull some like self-care kind of like life oracle kind of cards, and then a cosmic journey card, and then we'll dive into a deeper message. So we're just going to dive in. Um, I'm catching up on my videos. I apologize that I've been MIA. I've just been super, super sick. So thank you so much for bringing with me, all of you guys, so much. Um, I'm trying to get these all uploaded for you so that I can finally get back on my routine and my schedule. Every time that I want to get back on schedule and that I want to get back on my routine, Things seem to happen. So I'm just going with the flow, listening to my body, listening to what I'm supposed to do. So thank you so much for bringing with me and for your love and support. So let's dive in and see. What do we got going on for Pisces for the rest of this month for February? Let's see, Pisces. What do we have going on for my Pisces for the rest of this month? What do we have going on for my Pisces for the rest of this month, February 2021? What do we have? Thank you. Which is perfect because that's what I wanted. I just kind of like wanted one. And then pull a couple and we'll just dive in. All right. So what can Pisces focus on for the rest of this month? What can Pisces focus on for the rest of this month? What can Pisces focus on? the rest of this month all right a couple more thank you all right so they got a lot for you pisces let's see let's dive into it let's dive into it because i think after these particular videos i'm caught up so all right and then we're going to do a cosmic journey card so let's move this pardon my mess pisces oh i'm trying to get like my office in like some sort of shape or order but oh it's been crazy because like i said i've been super sick and uh, funnily enough, not COVID. That's the funny thing. Just like a really bad like bug. Like, oh my God, it's been like horrible. But like horrible, like horrible, horrible, horrible. Anyway. All right, Pisces. And then I also wanted to get a cute card for you guys. And if need, clarify. Let me get a cute card for my Pisces. Thank you. Because that was the one I wanted to come out. All right, this could be bad. All right, and then I'm gonna clarify that. So let me clarify that. And then we'll jump in. All right, so let's see. Ooh, 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 ooh. All right. Why is this could be bad? Okay. All right, perfect. All right. All right, Pisces, let's jump in. All right, so your tarot message, um, Pisces, for the rest of this month, for something for you guys to focus on, okay, is the um is the um three of earth which is the three of pentacles right so teamwork collaboration um it's the power of creativity it says recognition for very high quality work be a team player so for the rest of this month right let's focus on that particular message about being a team player working well with others all right pisces 
Now you have several different like self-care, life care kind of oracles here. So let's get into it. So start a side hustle. It says the best way to become your own boss is to start a side hustle. I know a lot of you have been wanting to do that. So have fun again. Learn to love life again and try to enjoy life more by having fun. And it's your season. You should. Music. Music can heal wounds that medicine cannot touch. I'll tell you right now, I've been healing with music a lot. I love music. Positive affirmations. Using positive affirmations every day can change your life. Today is your day. Make a vision board. Remind yourself why you began this journey in this first place. Wake up early. Um, aim to wake up earlier in the morning to chase your dreams. Make new friends. Get out there and make new friends. Don't hide in the shadows. All right, and then your cosmic journey card, you guys got 11. Each evolutionary turn requires you to give up with who you think you are. I want to dive into that, though. So let's see. All right. So that says, at this threshold you have now come to, you must give up what you thought you were so you can move into who you truly are. Each and every turn on the evolutionary spiral requires you to fully step into another level of creation to usher in what's next. A step on the spiral might sometimes feel like a step backward, but there is only perfect progress on your pathless path as you surrender. Your identity is so deeply rooted in your roles, your car, your place in society, your bank account, your profession, all of it. It's time to shed your skin. Each turn has its own perils and rewards, both easier and harder every time. Harder to give up what came before, but easier because you know what's coming. Your next leap into galactic emergence. It says, what is the deepest identity I'm scared to give up? And then it says, map the highs and lows of the last three evolutionary jumps you've experienced. All right, so that's like an extra message for you guys. And then we have this could be bad, and I clarified it by the six of swords. And that's basically you're gonna, you're some of you are contemplating walking away from something over here, and it, they're kind of saying to maybe think about it for a little bit, like don't make any harsh decisions just yet, because it could be bad if you decide to walk away, and then you might not be able to recuperate this particular connection. So they're saying if you can try to hold the space and like be patient for a little bit longer it might not end up so bad, you know? So just be mindful of that. Like, don't just walk away from something so quickly. Like, just let things sit and just think about stuff, all right? Um, all right, so let's, that was that. <sighs> let's see, what else, Pisces? I feel like I wanna pull another card for you, Pisces. Yeah, I wanna end it with an ancestor card. Let's get an ancestor card as well. Ancestor. And I'm going to do a special birthday video for you guys as well. I just don't know what kind of video just yet, but I am going to do um, a bonus Pisces birthday, you know, like video for you guys. So stay tuned for that. All right. So you guys got David. Hold the space. Wasn't I just saying hold the space over here about this decision? Thank you. Okay. Trader, exchange energy to create abundance. For some of you, that is when you exchange energy with the person that you really have like a strong connection with. You guys get rejuvenated and then you create more abundance for yourself. So be mindful of that, all right? All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this reading, this little energy check-in for the month, for the rest of the month of February, 2021. I love you guys so much and I will see you guys next month. Bye, Pisces. Happy birthday.